Um, fear is, I mean, like, I don't want people to be, you know, not scared of failure. and like, yeah, I'm never gonna, you know, like, I, I'm just gonna give up my company. You still want people to have effort and really want to try, but like, I mean, like, but you know, scared of like a, a, a bad outcome in the beginning, I guess, right? So like, let me try to phrase this. Like, if people aren't scared of trying, I think it's a great thing. But people should still be scared of like, you know, not giving their best. Let me just say, if people become complacent with not doing their best, then we're in deep shit. But if, if it's people like, you know, yeah, not being scared of trying and you're putting your full effort in, I think it's a great, great thing for society in general. Isn't it going to be the case like that if everybody thinks that failing is okay, so let me just go out and try this, I feel I'm fine. It's like a badge of honor. I mean, as long as they're giving their best effort, I think it's fine. If people are just like, yeah, I'm gonna try, it was cool, um, I got $100,000 from an investor, and then I lost it, that sucks. That would be horrible, right? So, yeah, no, no, we, if, it has been people trying with passion, right? Like, I guess we have to, yeah, kind of almost, uh, like, define what, you know, trying and your failure is in that way, right? I think that's a good point. It's better to define what failure is. I mean, if you're not afraid of failure anymore, at least you get started. But there are so many other factors that determines whether you become successful or not. So failure is only a small part of failure. Uh, for me, failure is already part of the formula to get where you are right now. So um, the way I see it, of course, we don't want to invest on a company that going to fail. Our CEO don't want a, their company to fail. So it is actually somehow we tell ourselves it's not okay to fail. But you know, things happen. So that's that's when you're supposed to learn and you're supposed to uh, able to embrace failures. Not. Um, we're not encouraging the company that we invest to fail, but <laughs> we want them. Uh, we want well, we want to to hear that oh, uh, failure is not an option. That's what we want to hear. But uh, along the way, we know as you know, we're entrepreneurs as well, so we know what happened. I mean, uh, it, failures has become a formula to, to be where you are right now. So I guess just deal with it. Uh, bounce back really fast, that's what we want. Find a new solution. Once you see there's some kind of failure, that's what we want to see. Yeah, I mean, yeah, I mean, I, I think we all want to have perfect portfolios, right? Like, I, I mean, 30 companies have 30 exits, I am awesome. I mean, the reality's not gonna happen, but yeah, we would love to have that. But yeah, I mean, like, if you don't give me your best effort and I invest in you, you're gonna be on my shit list. I'll just put you there. Like, like, if you do not try, I will disown you and I will make sure anybody who ever asked me for a referral, I'm gonna tell you how much a piece of shit you are, right? But like, if you do give your best and you just went down in flames, I'm totally fine with that. I mean, I don't wanna see that happen. None of us do. Either as an entrepreneur, but we will get there. I think all of us will agree that 100%, right? I mean, as an investor, if you invest in people, you put in money and we want you to try with the money. We don't want you to go to the safety route, put in your money in the FD deposit, and then, hey, our burn rate is zero. There's no decades that you can run on your money. No, just try, push. There was this entrepreneur I met a long time ago, and he told me, you know, I make mistakes every day. And he said, the day I don't make a mistake, I understand for myself, I haven't pushed the boundary far enough on that day. So it's fine to make mistakes. Very cool.